Our game, 4009 Leagues Under the Sea, is a water game without water because we know safety hazard. One of the main parts that we wanted our game to have is that it's going to be easy to rookie team or easy for rookie teams to play, but pose a challenge to veteran teams like they've never seen before. Our, the game features a 12-foot crack in the middle of our field that acts as a revolving door. Teams are able to use this element of the game to score points. Teams are able to do this by getting the cracking face away from their side of the field, and for every second they're able to do this, they get one point. And up here on this part of the field, we have a coral reef that serves as an obstacle to robots. The coral reef has different heights in it, similar to the 2016 game, that poses a challenge for robots to fastly get across the field. Another unique aspect about our game is the auto portion. Similar to 2019 Sandstorm, teams aren't able to see their the field at all, but they're also not able to use their cameras. Teams are still able to use an auto, but if they don't have an auto, they're able to use a periscope located behind the goals in order to see the entire field. The periscope tests a team's ability to really communicate with each other. And then from a chain aspect of the game, the chains are connected to the goals, and during the end game period of the game, teams have to try to lift every single chain connected to each of the treasure chests in order to lift the treasure chests up. If teams are able to do this successfully, they're able to score a rank point.